Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Michelin Motor Show updates from the motorcycles in Cologne. We bring you back to Paris to talk cars. Now, Kartikeya, I know you have your eye on the Thruxton and I promise you'll get to ride it <laughs> after this. But today I want to talk to you about a car that, well, it's a little confusing because it's a car that we all love. It's doing great numbers in India and it's the Duster. It was launched in 2017 in Europe, but it's the end of 2018, well, almost. <laughs> it still isn't here. What's going on? Duster is a bit of an icon for Renault. It's been like a really celebrated uh, offering from Renault. And since it was unveiled, we've all been wondering like, when is it coming? And by now it's like, why has it not come yet? I mean, they say it's an all new Duster and that caused people's eyebrows to go up because it looks so similar to the previous generation Duster. Every single body panel on the new Duster is different, but it still looks pretty much the same. With the new generation, it has a lot of the traits of the Duster, yeah. a simple, nice, chunky looking SUV, yeah. and it still looks like that, but it looks slightly different. And the more you look at it, it becomes more apparent. So I like it. Up in front, you have a chrome slotted grille, you have yeah. LED DRLs, a new design on the headlamp and the tail lamp cluster as well. But if you look at the sides, what I find interesting is the badging for, essentially here we have Dacia, but it's it's the plastic uh, that's behind it. It looks a little yeah. bit more rugged. But I, for one, am a big fan of two things, the wheels and the okay. hood design. Very okay. aggressive. In fact, to me, I don't know, it might be a little bit controversial, but it looks like a baby discovery. Moving on, the bigger change with the new Duster, however, is on the inside. It's completely overhauled. So if you guys were wondering why the new Duster has not come just like we were, I think the answer has been unveiled now at the Paris Motor Show, right? Right. We're seeing a new dashboard, new instrument cluster, so the design has changed and it looks nice, it looks more trendy. Uh, materials, I think we're not too sure, still kind of the tough variety that we used to seeing in a duster. But I don't mind that, it looks nicer. And along with that, they're offering more equipment now. Absolutely, it's taken a bit more of a premium approach. So you have uh, things like the what the capture gets, that, that credit card like keyless entry system. Correct. It yeah. gets, gets cruise control, a few more creature comforts. But the biggest update of all is the 7-inch infotainment display, which now comes with Apple CarPlay <laughs> and Android Auto. <laughs> So that is the answer, the reason why they Correct. hated it, because they knew that if they bought the duster as it was to India, people wouldn't have been happy with the interiors, we all would have complained. Yeah. But now I guess we have our answer there. What about the power trains? So uh, I think before we move to the power trains, there are other finer tweaks sure. as well inside yeah. the cabin, like I believe the seats have been reworked mm -hmm. for to offer greater comfort, new steering wheel. So everything on the inside has been tweaked that little bit to make it that much nicer, right? And then when it comes to what's under the hood, there are new petrol engines now on offer. Renault updated the diesels already when the Duster came out earlier on last year. But now there's a new petrol engine, which I don't know whether it's going to come to India. It's a new turbo engine. It's a 1.3, 120-ish yeah. horsepower. Yeah, so I don't know about the relevance about that for the Indian market right now. But yeah, they've updated the Duster from last year, even for Europe. Mm -hmm. So now it feels like the package is ready to come to India, right? Yeah. Another feature that I find interesting is, uh, of course, the four-wheel drive, uh, all-wheel yeah. drive variant rather continues but it now has a multi-camera system mm. so for obstacle avoidance oh, really? and collision as well Duster is really capable off-road we've seen that with the all-wheel drive you take that thing off-road and you'll be surprised yeah. with what it can do with. and with this it gives you that added little bit of convenience and you know the fun factor as well gizmos When can we expect it to finally hit Indian shores? 2019, we should definitely be seeing it here in India, but when exactly? I don't have an exact fix on that, but I think the first half should uh, make sense. You look at the way the prices have gone for the existing duster, mm -hmm. so they have gone down lower, so when the new one comes along, it will be where the duster sat, kind of. It's not going to get too much more expensive. I wouldn't expect it to get too much more expensive because it's still a simple, hardy machine that uh, Renault, Dacia, 
uh, have an offer there in Europe, right? And I think that value set will continue to be offered here in India as well. Sure. And if you go further up the range, you have the capture then. Yeah, exactly. They've got that as well. Nissan will have the kicks and Nissan will have a version of this as well, I'm sure, in time. So there you go folks, that's the loader on the Dacia, the Renault Duster as it will be known when it comes to India in the new Avtar and truly new Avtar now, right? We know why Renault held back from bringing it to India and now it makes sense. I think it's time now, right? Okay. It's updated all around now. So there you have it folks, the Dacia Duster, but don't close that tab just yet because Michelin has got you covered. From scooters to two-wheelers to performance machines to even small little SUVs like this, they have great tyres for all your vehicle needs. And we're also going to give away a pair of tyres for either your two-wheeler or four-wheeler. And how to win it? Well, stay tuned till the end of this video to find out just that. And from Germany and Paris, we are bringing you fresh motoring content from the world of motor shows. Stay tuned. This is Pardrift. We'll catch you on the other side.